good afternoon from Jaffna, Sri Lanka. You guys might be wondering, why the heck do you have this huge helmet on? Because it's the new fashion. This is how I like to look now. No, I'm just kidding. But I'm actually, I rented this scooter right here. Boom, this is my ride for the day. This is the new Ducati. Pretty nice, no? But yeah, I am actually headed off to some islands, which are located right outside the coast of uh, Jaffna. The islands that you have to, you can drive to because there's bridges. Um, I wanted to see what the beaches are like here. I heard they're pretty nice islands. So today, we're gonna go check out some islands and some beaches known as... Hello, how are you? We're gonna go check out some islands and beaches. I forgot the name of it, I have to look it up, but I'll let you guys know as we get into the island what the names are of the island. And um, yeah, I'll check in with you guys. So maybe I'll show you some views along the way. But it's a great bike. The only issue with this bike is that there is no uh, pocket to put my things in. So it's gonna be tough to film and drive at the same time. But we'll make do, we'll make do. So guys, I'm just riding through this road on my way to the Chatty Beach. That's the name of the beach, Chatty Beach. I'm almost there. There's a random cow crossing here, but some nice temple. But man, it's like dead here. There's nothing here. It's literally just a one straight road, no shops, no nothing. But yeah, apparently I'm almost at Chatty Beach. So, but it's beautiful though. It's a really nice scenic ride though. I don't know if you're seeing from the shots, but amazing. It's a beautiful ride. And we are approaching the beach now. This is the quietest beach area I have ever been to. I've been to some remote places in the Philippines, but this is so quiet. There's no one here. And it's really a nice piece to that. I really, really like it. As you can see, we're approaching the water. Now, I don't know if there's much beach area, but it's definitely some beautiful water here. Wow. We are at the edge of the country right now. Literally the edge of Sri Lanka. Hello. And it's beautiful, guys. It is remarkably beautiful look at this as i was driving through there's a random old mosque here as well right on the water it's quite amazing hello hello uh which way is uh the beach this is the beach ah okay thank you all right so oh, we're on the beach not much of a beach though as i said not like uh the beaches that you might be used to seeing or I was used to seeing in the Philippines or in Bali, the same that beach. But it's a lot more peaceful and a lot less people, that's for sure. Alrighty guys, we have arrived to the Chatty Beach. It's very breezy here. Easy breezy. The water is beautiful though. And there's like no one here to see a few people down there and that's pretty much it. Wow. So the water on the banks is a bit murky, but as you get a more out, you'll see the water is definitely more blue and very beautiful. It's amazing guys. Like I am literally at the edge 
of Sri Lanka right now. So there's, you could do island hopping here. Like there's a few islands. It's like I can go to that island over there as well. Uh, and the cool thing is you could do it all on a bike, which is really awesome. So this one is Chatty Beach. Then there's another island over there called Pundu Vakil or something like that. I'm sorry, these Sri Lankan names are very tough to pronounce. So forgive me if I'm saying them wrong. But yeah, guys, it's a beautiful place though. and very remote. I literally feel like I'm in the middle of nowhere right now. Also, another thing to note, there's not much here as far as like shops and like places to like get food or anything. There's nothing here. So you probably have to like bring things with you if you want. But with that being said, it's a beautiful scenic ride to the beach. And you can sit in these bungalow things as well that they have. You'll probably bring drinks or food with you if you wanted to and yeah it's a nice nice beach experience here in uh in sri lanka so apparently there are supposed to be resorts here like oh wow uh so apparently there's supposed to be resorts here like i saw a chatty beach resort or something like that but it looks like maybe they were never built Looks like the area never really took off, so who knows? But people just chilling out here. Hello, brother. How are you? Okay. This is uh, Chadi Beach. Huh? Chadi Beach. Very nice. Is there some places to eat food here or anything like that? Is there a place to eat food or something like that? Shops here? Shop. No? no? No shop. Alright. Okay. Very nice. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Alright guys, so as you heard the man, no. There is nothing here. So what I'm going to do is hey! make, I'm gonna make moves. I'm gonna head out to the next island and I'll show you guys. I'm sure it's probably not much different. One thing I'm noticing is as I'm driving, there's so many churches and temples everywhere. Like, there's more churches and temples than shops and people. I guess these people must be very religious people in the area because all I'm seeing is places to worship. I mean, they're beautiful, but I don't see any people. So I wonder who goes to these churches. I see a lot of buildings and houses that look like they were like about to build them but then it's just been abandoned and they stopped doing it because maybe it just didn't work out or maybe they thought this area was going to be the next booming beach town area and it just didn't pan out the way they expected but a lot of abandoned houses and building projects also I'm noticing and then you do have some really beautiful houses like this one here so there are people that live here as well I love the sprawling high palm trees and coconut trees it's beautiful oh, guys look finally some civilization found a gas station and there's a shop here also but not much in it. Hello. And a vegetable shop. And more shops. Very interesting. Oh, it looks like there's like a little town here. Let's see if we can get ourselves a little cold drink here. Stop off. The problem is, I only have a 5,000 rupee bill and I don't even know if they'd have change for that over here. So we shall find out. Alright. Ooh, they got those vegetable rolls. I love these. Hello. Hello. Hi. Are you the chef? Yeah. This one, uh, vegetable? Hi. Hello. Hello. This one, uh, vegetable? Yeah. Can I have, a? Uh, 
Two vegetable rolls? Two. Yeah. And a drink. Two? Yeah. And let's get a water. You have a water bottle? Water bottle. Bottle? Yeah. One half. Yeah? Only one liter? One half? I got mad. One and a half liter? Oh, that's a big one. Yeah, no problem. I'll take it. Hi. <laughs> yeah. How much? For those two and this? This is a random little restaurant. Hi, boss. Oh. What's the name of this area? Oh. What's the name of this place? Wangalava. Huh? Wangalava. 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 No problem. No, I, I, I take this now, yeah. No problem. I eat it now. Thank you, brother. Thank you so much. Four. Eight. Thank you, brother. Okay. Thank you. Huh? I'm from US. US. Yeah, US. Thank you. All right, guys. So I got myself some snacks from this place. We're gonna try it out and see how it tastes. And some water as well. Keep myself going in this heat. So yeah, guys, we are literally in the middle of nowhere right now. I get the feeling that they don't see foreigners too much here, you know? The good thing is, being a brown guy, I kind of blend in here, you know? Well, I don't look too much like an outsider, but... They can definitely tell I'm not from here. Just by the way I'm dressed and all that, but I love these vegetable rolls, they're so good. Mm. Hi brother. What are you watching? YouTube? Watch my channel. My channel. Yeah. Yeah. M Y I make videos traveling. I'm making a video about this area. Thank you, brother. What's your name? Raul. Raul. You're from this area? Linux. Linux? Where is that? Sales. It's close? Sales. Ah, okay, okay. Very nice. Alright guys, just gonna finish up these snacks and then head over. I'm almost at the other island, so I should be there soon. So the roads were really nice before. As you're riding to this uh, second island uh, that I'm headed to now, the roads get really, really rough. Especially for a scooter. It's not easy. So this is like a long bridge which takes you to the next island. But it's a beautiful breeze that you get from the water here. And the water is actually really clean and blue the more you look out. It's amazing. But the roads are really rough. Super rough roads. I got a great vantage point on the water here. I mean, you can literally just see out into the distance. And there's little houses over here. I don't know if you can see it by on the camera, but there's little homes all the way out. I mean, who the heck would live all the way down there? It's amazing. 
We've got these boats here on the coast. But yeah, guys, this is the most remote beaches I've ever seen. Like, no one here. You'll see a few cars passing by, a few tuk-tuks passing by here and there, but this is literally the most... Hello! <laughs> this is the most remote place as far as beaches are concerned that I've ever been. And I, I like it. It's a vibe. But you don't want to get lost out here. No one will find you. But the water is beautiful. I think the name of this is Punda La Vela. I don't know, something like that. Correct me in the comments if I'm wrong, if anyone knows. But if you come to Jaffna, rent a scooter and just take a ride around. These beaches aren't the kind of beaches that you will like chill and relax on, but beautiful to see, beautiful to just take a ride and soak it all in. So as I was heading back to civilization, I passed this sweet shop and I want to see what kind of sweets do they really have here. Let's see, anything interesting. Ice cream? Hmm. Rico ice cream. Veni sweets. What kind of sweets? Let's see. Hi, brother. Hello. Uh, you have sweets? Next shop? Next shop? Okay. Hello. Hi. Hello. Do you have sweets? Huh? Ice cream? Yeah? Where's the ice cream? Up there. Huh? <laughs> oh, sorry. Hi. Yeah. Where's the ice cream? It's an ice cream shop, but I don't see ice cream. I don't see any sweets besides some biscuits. Hello. Do you have any sweet? No? No. Ah, okay. No problem. Uh, I don't think they understand what I'm saying. This is just an empty shop. Ooh, what's the sun crush? Looks good. Ooh, it's cold too. Red apple. Let's try some red apple sun crush. That looks good. Huh? I said, I'm 150 to be special. Where is the ice cream? Ice cream? Yeah. Parcel. Yeah? Parcel? I don't know. Ice cream. I'm so cold. <laughs> Where is it? Huh? Yeah. Okay. Can I see the ice cream? Yes. Can I see the ice cream? Where is the ice cream? Yeah? Okay. Oh, it's bad here. <laughs> oh, very nice. Which one is this one? Ala. Pista? Yeah? Can I have this one? Huh? This one? This one. The green Ala. one. Yeah, yeah. Ala, okay, just that. Only that. And the green one too, ma. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, whatever. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Do you have a cone? Cone? Cone. Yeah? In a cone. Okay, in a cone, not this. In a yeah, cone. cone. Yeah, cone. Very nice. Okay. <laughs> <Wow>. <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> oh, very nice. Okay, we have some ice cream. Ah, thank you. Hmm. Hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. It's like a pistachio. It's very good. Thank you. So, basically, yeah, it's like a coconut. Also, like pistachio. Very good. Super yummy. Mm. Nothing cools you off like some good ice cream. Mm. I've been seeing a lot of ice cream in this area, like everywhere, there's ice cream shops. I think it's like a common thing because, well, my guess is that they don't use cows to eat. 
they just get the milk from them because this is a Hindu area, so they don't actually eat beef. So it's very interesting. But I'm good. You are from? I'm from the U.S. Ah. Yeah. And you? This place? What? You're from here? Yes. Oh, right. oh, beautiful. Nice, nice place. The ice cream was super yummy and it's 50 rupees, which if you count it in dollars is like yes. um, maybe not even 10 cents or something. No, actually like 25 cents. Okay, I leave it here. Okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye bye. Some Rico ice cream guys in the middle of Velani, I think that's the name of the town, but close to Chadi Beach. But anywho guys, um, I showed you guys the beach, took a nice ride around. Who else is giving you this kind of content here in Sri Lanka? Nobody. So make sure you subscribe and stay tuned for more Sri Lanka videos. And uh, remember, continue to learn, continue to grow, and there is no growth until you leave your comfort zone. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out.